Welcome to the Setting Up Users module. In this session, we'll introduce you to the Sage CRM Setting Up Users features. Our goals are to enable you to create user templates, to create new users from templates, to assign special user rights, and to define user security profiles. As a system administrator, you can create new user accounts using templates. Templates make it easy for you to apply a set of common characteristics to more than one user or a team of users. Templates make it easy for you to apply the same settings to more than one account. Sage CRM ships with a set of predefined templates and allows you to create your own. To create a new template, you first need to select the Administration button to display the Administration page. Next, you select Users. Then, you select User Templates. You click on the New button on the right-hand side of the interface. Now you type the name of the new template in the Template Name field. Next, you select appropriate values for the Based on Template, Primary Team, and Home Territory drop-down lists as shown. When you have finished, click on the Continue button. Now you enter the additional user information required in the More User Details and Security panels. You can, for example, include Info Admin Rights on the template. By assigning users info admin rights, you enable them to perform basic administration tasks, such as setting up marketing campaigns, customizing email templates, and resetting passwords. First, select Info Manager on the Administration drop-down menu. Notice that the list box containing the info admin rights have been made available for selection. You select the Info Admin Rights you want to assign the user by clicking on each individual option while pressing Control. You click on the Continue button when you are finished. This screen displays the default preference setting. You can change these default settings and then click on the Save button. Before you create new user accounts, we recommend that you create user templates for each group of users. When you have already created a template containing the required settings, you can use it to define similar settings for multiple CRM user accounts. In the Administrator menu, you select Users. Then, you select New Users. You enter the required user details in the User panel. On the User Template drop-down menu, you select the template you want to apply to this user. Values are automatically selected in the Administration, Primary Team, and Home Territory drop-down lists according to the template settings, but you may need to adjust them. You click on the Save button to save the user account's new settings and to skip the next two steps if you do not want to make any adjustments. The default settings defined in the selected user template are applied to this new user. You simply repeat the process for each user account. You can manage security access rights across the organization by setting up security profiles. With security profiles, you can regulate what rights users have to view, edit, insert, and delete various categories of data in the CRM system. When you have created a security profile, you assign users to them. For example, you can create a sales security profile and assign it to all sales staff to define what data categories they can view and whether they can have edit, insert, and delete rights to that data. Therefore, before you create a security profile for a department, 
you need to consult the relevant manager to decide what rights should be included. First, you select Users on the Administration page. You select Security. And then you select Security Profiles. You click on the New Profile button. You type the name of the new profile in the Description field. And then you click on the Save button. Now you select the hypertext link to the new security profile. In the Rights panel, you click the checkboxes beside the rights you want to assign the user. When you have done this for all the views, you click on the Save button. The Sales Security Profile appears in the list. To move users into this profile, you select the hypertext link to the new security profile. Now click on the Move User Into This Profile button. In the Add User panel, you click on the Find button. Select the user you want to add to the profile and click on the Add button. You repeat the steps for additional users and then click on the Save button. You have now added the selected users to the Sales Security Profile. Now you can create user templates, create new users from templates, assign special user rights, and define user security profiles.